सो हाई डर टॉरस अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जनरल रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द टॉरस सन मून विनस राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जनरल इट माइट और माइट नॉट रेजोनेट विद यूर द फर्स्ट प्लेस द सेकेंड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फॉर मे ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री थर्ड थिंग दिस इज नॉट अ लव रीडिंग बट वट एवर विल कम आई विल जस्ट लेट यू गाइज नो सो ओवरऑल फोकस एरिया फॉर टॉरस पीपल फॉर दिस मंथ ऑफ मे ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री लेट्स यू वट्स गोइंग टू हैपन लेट्स यू वट्स कमिंग टू वर्ड्स टू इन मे ट्वेंटी Four of Wands. Okay, so your overall focus area is going to be on stability, long-term stability, partnerships. Okay, uh, in some cases you are going to find somebody to get married, but uh, for most of you, uh, obviously marriage is not going to be on the uh, like mind for every Taurus. So uh, for uh, for others of you, it will be celebrating life, celebration, your birthday month. You will be celebrating. You will be in, in this energy of okay, let me be, uh, let me have fun. let me find my stability with happiness so finding your stability and uh, keeping yourself happy this is going to be your overall focus area okay having fun that's it having fun and celebrating life and uh, simultaneously trying to figure out a way to be in a stable kind of energy in your life stable in all every area of your life physically mentally emotionally spiritually <laughs> four pillars four uh, focus areas Let's see in the recent past what was happening for Taurus people. Two of Swords. You were on the crossroads regarding a situation from a very very long time. You were not able to see the clear picture of the future, uh, and you were in this energy of okay, am I on the right path or not? Okay, so you were on the crossroads regarding something or someone in the recent past, and we will clarify each card one by one. Let's see in in your current energies what is happening. Knight of Wands. You are right now very, very passionate, very, very passionate, very, very energetic, very, very enthusiastic. You are in this energy of no matter what, what I am going to do that. You have some kind of agenda or you have some kind of you know a purpose in your mind, and you are in this energy of no matter what I am going to do this, or I am going to have that trip, or I am going to have that uh, you know uh, yoga classes or meditation classes, or I am going to do this because I want to do it. Okay, I will clarify this card. Let's see by the end of May. what is coming towards you taurus wow it's a pentacles a beautiful opportunity is coming your way uh, coming your way a very very stable kind of opportunity that has the that has the potential to become something very very huge in the future okay now it could be related to money business i hope uh, most probably it's uh, related to money business job career uh, but uh, it could be related to your uh, love life also let's clarify Let's clarify the four of wands as the overall focus area for Taurus people for the month of May. Finding your stability. Five of cups, death, and the eight of swords. Wow, a period of loneliness, sadness, depression is ending in your life. You are going to be in this energy of okay. I came out of this uh, period of sadness, loneliness, and depression, and everything successfully. What next? you will be overthinking about uh, what next okay you will be in the synergy of i have to find my stability i have to find my in some cases i have to find my happily ever after in some cases i have to enjoy life and find my stability in every area of my life but how to do that you will be constantly overthinking about how to do that how to find that stability how to find that happiness how to find that uh, celebration kind of energy within yourself within your energies this is going to be your overall focus area or you can say challenge this month let's see in the recent past you had the two of swords so you were constantly conflicted about something or someone no matter how hard you were trying to let go of uh, uh, conflict and confusion you were not able to do that because you were not able to see the clear picture of things uh, in your your life six of pentacles empress and the judgment card okay you were conflicted about a particular situation related to money job career growth and expansion something that you felt like okay is very very stable it could be a love relationship it could be money matters you felt like this is a highly stable kind of situation and uh, we are having equal give and take give and take of energy and we are having growth and expansion too but you need it you know you need it to release something or someone so that you can get the balance back or uh, have the growth and expansion but you were not sure how to do that you were not able to release something or someone out of your life completely even though on the surface level you were like okay i have forgiven that person i have forgiven myself for whatever i did whatever fucked up messed, messed up thing i did but you were not able to let go of them let go of that situation let go of that uh, uh, belief or let go of that uh, 
whatever whatever is holding you back and you were constantly in the crossroads situation what should i do should i wait should i let it go completely it could be money related issues like money job career related issues that you were uh, uh, not able to connect with not able to solve or a uh, job like uh, your relationship area in some cases it could be a family member that created some kind of chaos in your life and uh, you you had forgiven them but you were not able to forgive and forget you were not able to let go so take it how it resonates with you in whatever area of your life it's resonating current situation is the knight of wands i told you there is uh, this heavy desire of doing something taking some kind of action yeah i'm sorry about this so you are in this passionate kind of energy you have certain desire in your life and you feel like i'm going to take action no matter what so let's clarify this is not typical taurus nature actually to do something in passion and fire but let's see what is what is bothering you what you are feeling like you should do uh let's see we have the ace of cups and three of swords and the knight of swords it's directly related to your emotions you are trying to run away from the pain that you are feeling you're still still you are in a painful energy still you feel like uh, some sort of connection or relationship or you know emotional kind of bonding with somebody okay or with somebody or something and you are not able to let it go it's very very painful for you right and now you are in this energy of no matter what i am i will let it go and i will start a new chapter of my life with something new or someone new but i am never going to let this pain get the best out of me in some cases even if it is painful you are trying to run away from the pain because you are trying to heal this pain from a very long time taurus and now you are like i'm fed up of healing i cannot heal this anymore i have to let it go and i have to start with the brand new chapter of my life no matter what whether again whether it's your family situation or your work situation or it's a love relationship that's still hurting you still painful you will be this energy of no nope, not again not again or uh, i'm not going to repeat the same cycle again with myself i'm going to you know start a new chapter with something new or someone new and uh, i will uh, erase this pain out of my life completely it's never going to happen like this but any in any way at the current moment you are trying to do that cover the pain with something that you feel like you are really love or really like trying to run away from the pain don't do that taurus it's going to haunt you later what's the use of that okay now by the end of this month i do see a fantastic brand new opportunity knocking at your at your door and it has the potential to become something very very solid and stable in the future let's see what is that let's see the moon the four of wands the emperor card okay you are very worried about stability long term partnership and uh, commitment or marriage kind of energy in your life even though something new is coming out okay even no even though someone is coming to you or something new is coming to you you will you will not be able to trust that uh, event or trust that per, that person or tr trust that situation completely even though on the outer surface taurus you will be in the synergy if i got it i got it i know what i have to do i'm very stable minded i'm very honest with myself i'm very loyal with myself but inside of you lot of turmoil lot of stress lot of anxiety will be going on continuously regarding long term kind of future about something or someone uh, i think uh, there will be a new person new energy adding up in your uh, business or money or job or career area uh, and you will be constantly in this energy of okay i got a very good opportunity i will make the best use of it i am going to be stable in my life finally i got it but inside of you you will be like okay like a like a like a kid you will be very very scared that okay what if it is never going to work out what if it is going to you know give me the same pain or give me the same uh, uh, fears that i had in the past what if what if what if you will be having lots of what ifs but the moral of the story is that by the, by the end of may 2023 you will be making some kind of solid decisions in your life you will be leveling up to the level of emperor and you will be making good use of this uh, uh, opportunity even if it is even if you will not be very sure about this but you will be taking it okay and making something good out of it again uh for most of you it's a business money job career opportunity but for others of you it can be related to your uh, like commitment marriage or relationships also if you are focused on that area it depends on what area of your life you are focused on if you are focused on both the areas 
i do see in both the areas opportunity is coming but again uh, you are not going to be very sure about it so you are going to take some kind of decision life changing decision regarding that situation in your life hmm? leveling up and grabbing the opportunity okay even if you are uh, not sure you will be doing it and it has a potential to become something very beautiful in the future so just take it obviously it's if it's too risky if it's too unreliable don't do it obviously it's your choice it's your life but something has the potential to become something very very huge in the future let's see what is the guidance for you people we have the knight of wands seven of wands knight of pentacles okay so if you okay if you want to enjoy life if you want to be in this energy of okay i have to manifest this also that also that also stability also happiness also growth also expansion also and fun also you have to liberate yourself in this card this lady is trying to protect herself from everything that's coming her way okay everything that's not good for her that she feels is not good for her but taurus the truth of the story is we have to experience everything before uh, we get to the point where we actually get the goal of our life fulfilled okay so if you are going to be closed off about everything that is coming your way every experience that's coming your way you are never going to reach to the point of stability or happiness that you really want because experiences are very very important so in some case, like uh, because of love might be you are very very hurt okay and you are trying to protect yourself from being hurt again i truly understand that but until unless you are going to going to be open to new people new experiences how you are going to recognize whether it's good for you or bad for you okay so same is applied to the all areas of your life you have to take the risk you have to be um, you know uh, enthusiastic like a kid you have to be uh, vulnerable like a kid so you have to see life from a angle of a kid from the eyes of a kid simultaneously keep healing yourself don't jump into anything just like uh, just like that take your time but you have to be open and ready to receive all the experiences all the situations that the universe wants to uh, like send you then only you will be able to get what you really want in your life right yep keep healing yourself but be open to new people new situation and new experiences also come out of your comfort zone and the stability the loyalty the honesty or whatever money job career love whatever you are trying to manifest that will start coming to you because you will be happy you will be open to experiences you will be in this energy of no matter what's coming my way i'm going to be happy i'm not going to be affected by all this because i have uh, this time i'm starting from experience right this is a huge thing think about it so thank you so much for tuning in to us i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste